You need a financial advisor with the freedom to focus on your specific needs. Whatever your goals, Reed Potter can create a game plan tailored to you. Call Reed at 432-0777 at Pikeville, Kentucky to learn more. Special tribute concert set to honor the legacy of former UPOC College Band Director Jim Andy Cottle. We have our first concert of the season coming up on October 8th. Um, this is a great opportunity for our main groups to uh, really sort of jump in and get their feet wet uh, with, uh, with the music making of the season. It'll feature our concert band, our concert choir, and our uh, select vocal group, our chamber singers. Cottle's talents extended far beyond the conductor's podium. He was an accomplished composer and a skilled trumpeteer. To honor his legacy and his impactful contributions, the UPOC band will perform a piece written and composed by Cottle himself. He was a professor here for about 20 years, and he also wrote a lot of pieces for a concert band, actually during his time here teaching. So he actually wrote it for this group. It's really homegrown music. And uh, we are performing one of those pieces uh, in his honor called Odyssey. The concert is not only a tribute to Jim Andy Cottle, but also an invitation for the entire community to come together and celebrate the enduring power of music. You can expect uh, uh, your standard concert band, concert choir uh, events, very classical centered music. We've got some fun tunes, some serious tunes, but uh, uh, really it's something for everybody who comes to watch. The concert is absolutely free. Um, we, uh, we encourage everyone from the community to come out. There'll be a little bit of something for everyone. Uh, both uh, Professor Denman and I enjoy a wide variety of music and program a wide variety for our students, so there'll be a little bit of everything. Mark your calendars for October 8th at 3 p.m. and make your way to the Booth Auditorium in the Record Memorial Building for what promises to be an evening filled with heartwarming music and memories. Reporting from Mountain Top News, I'm Ethan Miller.